So, me, hi, Tres, how are you? The Romanian singer in this year's song contest. Um, what's your impression of Malta so far? You've been here since yesterday. Malta is so great that I will come back in, uh, in the summer for sure here. Uh, I was in so many countries, but Malta is number one, surely. Uh, your song, Tornero, there are parts of it in Italian. How come? Italian and the Romanian, it seems uh, close. Um, I think uh, Italia doesn't uh, join the, the contest this year. And I think it's a good idea to, to be someone to will, who will sing in Italian. And uh, English is a new universal language, everybody will understand. And I choose uh, both languages because uh, uh, I think it's a plus yeah, for the song. The song is catchy and dance, and I think people will understand it better and will like more. And apart from singing, who is Mihai? Who is Mihai? Mihai is a young boy, a uh, modest one, a simple one. Uh, I'm a teacher of mathematics, actually, but I, I didn't uh, teach because I start singing and, uh, and uh, singing is my job now and I make money from singing. Uh, Mihai is a, a simple guy who wants to become a uh, well-known artist and appreci an appreciate one. Uh, I think Eurovision Song Contest is it's a chance to become an international star. So I I tried in our national final six times just to join this contest, and every time I was number two or three. And this year um, I choose a dance song. This year every time I sang ballads in uh, this contest, and uh, now I choose song and they send me. Now you will represent Romania, and I'm very proud and so happy. You also won various other contests, like the Golden Stag. Uh, Malta is part participates in the Golden Stag every year as well. Um, uh, how can you describe that festival? It's quite popular here in Malta too. I heard about the Golden Stag, that is uh, the second festival after, uh, after, I don't know exactly, maybe. After Eurovision. After Eurovision. It's the biggest festival, one of the biggest festival, international festival. Uh, in the contest uh, it was um, Cristina Aguilera, uh, uh, seven years ago about. She wasn't a big star then, but uh, then she became a big star. So it's a very big festival. I saw there Eleanor Casar, she won the Grand Prix, yeah. I saw Olivia New Lewis, uh, I saw Fabrizio, and I, I heard about Claudia Faniola will be this year there in the contest. And uh, have you heard any other songs in this year's contest? And are there any favorites of yours? In all countries. From all countries this year? I heard all the songs and all the clips uh, they are on, on the internet. Uh, and um, I can predict, uh, you, you will ask uh, uh, who, who will win. I can't predict uh, the song. Who Which are your favorites? I have many favorites. This year is, uh, is a, a year with many favorites. Uh, so I, I can't predict exactly who will win. I like Armenia, I like Bosnia, Croatia, Sweden, Greece, Belgium. I like uh, uh, Poland, Norway, Malta. It's difficult to predict who will win. And um, are you looking forward to Athens? Are you a fan of the Eurovision Song Contest yourself? I'm a little fan because uh, I uh, I saw on the internet uh, all the national all some of the national uh, finals. I saw the first final; it was a Malta final, <laughs> and uh, there I, was, I I saw Fabrizio. I saw all the singers, and I said five favorites there is in Malta. There are in Malta: Fabrizio, uh, Claudia Faniello, um, Natasha and Charlene, uh, Olivia and Luis, and Eleonor, Eleonor Casar. And Fabrizio won, so I said they they choose well. In Romania and in Greece, I believe. Uh, what are your impressions of the Maltese singer? The first time when I met him was in um, in Germany four years ago. There is an organization there. It's called OGAE, and they call me and Fabrizio and other singers in Eurovision uh, finals. And then uh, I met him there. We had the uh, shows there. Uh, then I met him in Bulgaria, we had uh, shows there, and I met in Romania, in Greece, and in, in Malta. So I met him such a, so many times that we became friends. And your last message to all the viewers of ESCMalta.com? I wish good luck to Fabrizio. He is one of my favorite, and uh, his song is very, very easy to remember and very catchy dance song. Uh, his video clip is also uh, broadcasted on our televisions. Uh, and uh, if they will like 
tornerò, then give me one vote. One vote. Uh, tonight we have a party at Eurovision Passion. I know that you couldn't attend because of uh, flight uh, restrictions, uh, but as a token of our appreciation for for coming to Malta, first of all, and for having the intention to come to the party. We have the small trophy, um, thanks to Paul Target Limited. Uh, thank you for visiting our country, and wish you all the best in Eurovision 2006. Thank you very much. I will come back in Malta every time with so much pleasure. Malta is so great, and people here is so, so uh, lovely, and I will be there for sure. Thank you very much.